So I've known most of these girls since they were very young. And so I've watched them grow into who they are today. <laughs> but once I got to have them as students, I was able to really push them to reach their potential. I saw potential in them very early. We studied whenever we could on weekends. If we had extra time in class, we would study. So a lot of studying went into it, for sure. And we learned probably about 800 questions in total. I'll just call you, I'll call you so Milk is a career development event. It's a judging competition. There's many, many hours of studying that go into this competition. We basically just determine if the samples we were given are acceptable for consumption. We all did the same thing. There's problem solving. There's 10 samples of cheese in front of you, and each cheese is usually a different color than the others. We had to be prepared to take a milk production and milk marketing exam. Being able to say that we came out as national champions is huge because it just shows how much time we were willing to put in and how much hard work that we put into this competition. I don't think people understand what it is they do. Good afternoon. We are the members of the Texas Milk Quality Team. It suggests an undesirable practice on the farm allow these bacteria to enter the milking equipment. Milk use for pasteurization should be cooled to 45 degrees Fahrenheit or less. We hope our suggestions for improvement today assist their efforts. Thank you. But this is hours upon hours of memorization and consistency. It's a lot of pressure. This contest is very hard. Whatever they pursue, I know they're going to be successful because they're such hard workers. As of right now, I want to major in food science or something along those lines. Whenever I started my freshman year, it was a big interest to me and it automatically got my attention. And so I think that doing it for all four years of high school really helped me determine that that was what I wanted to do whenever I get out of high school. They are actively studying now for other competitions. All four of them are in volleyball and are just heavily involved in all things at our school. <laughs> so they stay very busy.